Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. The future of Mohamed Salah has long been a growing cause of consternation for Liverpool supporters. Talks between the 29-year-old representatives and the Reds have long since stalled. Salah is widely regarded as one of the best players in the world after scoring 153 goals in 239 appearances for Liverpool since his move from Roma in June 2017. But he now has just 15 months remaining on his existing deal. This season he has reached new heights, with brutal consistency and outstanding goals, notably his stunning solo efforts against Manchester City and Watford. He currently tops the Premier League goalscoring chart with 20. And is second on the assist table behind teammate Trent Alexander-Arnold. Combined, he has 30 direct goal involvements in the league alone, 12 more than any other player. But his long-term future has remained clouded in doubt, amid a contract counting down and a stand-off with. The club's top brass over what a new deal should look like. Other stars instrumental to Liverpool's successes under Jurgen Klopp have inked new lucrative contracts over the past year. But the team's biggest star has not. Gary Neville has long predicted Salah would use Liverpool as a stepping stone to join either Barcelona or Real Madrid. He doubled down in February 2020, stating, I said 18 months ago I thought Mo Salah would leave Liverpool. I think it's a little bit more simple in the sense of why Liverpool fans maybe don't demonstrate that. Love for Salah, and its affinity and loyalty. I think there's a feeling that he wants to go and play at Real Madrid. Hell go to Barcelona, hell take the big move. That's not a criticism of Mo Salah. I played with David Beckham. I played with Ruud van Nistelrooy, played with Cristiano Ronaldo, they wanted to aspire to win the Ballon d'Or. They wanted to play at Real Madrid, they wanted to be up in lights and play at the biggest clubs in the world. I think there's a feeling, affinity, loyalty, will he leave us? I think he could. I think he is ultimately using Liverpool potentially as a stepping stone for his career. He has aspirations, let's be honest, real. Madrid and Barcelona for a lot of players are the pinnacle. Will Mohamed Salah leave Liverpool this summer? Let us know in the comments below. Real and Barcelona have cherry-picked countless Premier League stars during the last decade or so, including Cristiano Ronaldo, Luis Suarez, Eden Hazard, Luka Modric, Zabi Alonso, Javier Mascherano, Tibor Coutoise and Gareth Bale. Now, the most recent claims over Salah's future, courtesy of Spanish outlet Sport, suggest that Barcelona, in a state of repair after their huge financial issues, are Considering signing Liverpool's prolific top scorer. Certainly, if Salah still desires that final big move, then this summer may be Liverpool's final opportunity to get something in return. In contrast to his Sky Sports partner, ex-Liverpool defender Jamie Carragher has previously quashed the idea of Salah joining one of the Spanish giants. Both clubs have racked up substantial debt in recent years and continue to struggle to compete with the Premier League elite's wealth. I don't think it's a debate as much now as it was a few years ago, said the Liverpool icon. Even when Manchester United were top dogs and Cristiano Ronaldo went to Real Madrid it did still feel like a step up because Real Madrid is Real Madrid. But now I just think the two Spanish giants have fallen so far, I really do. Salah has got two and a half years to go on his contract. I'm not really looking at it as too much of a problem because Real Madrid spent a lot of money. On Eden Hazard when he was at that age of 28 or 29. Salah is just getting to that age. Now and I just think it's that year or two too late. When you go and spend real big money. On someone you want them to be about 25 or 26 so you're getting real value for them. I think. If he did go, and I don't see it, it would be massive money for Liverpool, but I just think. The time has gone because of the age. Will Neville or Carragher be proven right? Ultimately, it will be down to Liverpool and Salah to decide. 